welcome back to my channel. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, if I'm talking kind of raspy or um, kind of quiet, it's because I um, I'm sick and my my throat goes from sore to being okay to slightly sore really quick. Um, so I'm really trying to get this filmed. And yes, I do have my glasses on today. Today I had no school because there was um, Casey text Casey testing, which was the exit exam and the ends of my hair were in a bun, whatever. So I didn't have school because I'm a senior. Thank God. Oh, <laughs> yeah, but I hope you guys like that glare doesn't bother you because I'm using natural lighting. But it's. I wish I was coming on to this video on a happier note. Um, I am here to do. Um, it's a slight haul. I say that. I'm completely prepared. I doubt if it will be. I'm pretty sure. This whole. Sorry, I got me a new baby lips. This is the one in ten peppermint. I can't see it, but whatever. Um, this is going to be a review on a website. No, I was not contacted by the website. No, they probably won't like that I'm making this video, but, you know, I just want to let you guys know because when I came on and did a website, there was not a lot of videos about it. There was actually, like, no videos about it, um... So, let's basically start with the beginning. Okay, so in the beginning, I was looking for a prom dress. I was had I, I was seeing some, but they weren't at the prices that were good. You know, I was looking for some good prices, and I found this website. And they were like payment verifying and stuff. So I was like, oh, it must be a good website. They had cheap, they had brides' dresses and, you know, everything. And the website just looked so nice. The dresses were beautiful. And I seen one that caught my eye. Um, if I can show you. If I can find out, I'm trying to get the paper because. They send you a paper of oh, basically what this is. It's supposed to be like, and that would be uh, a good reference point in this video. But I guess I no longer have it. Um, it's not in the bag anymore. But I'll try to insert a right, uh, clip of it. But basically, it was supposed to be a lace dress um, with turquoise like under it. And then it was still supposed to flare out into not as big as a ball gown, but you know, it was supposed to come out at the bottom. And it was just gorgeous like a really, really gorgeous dress. I'm wishing I really have the picture right now. Um, I really can't find it and um, it was just gorgeous just gorgeous 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 <sighs> so first off when I ordered the dress and they said it was a turquoise color really beautiful high quality it was gonna come in a nice box folded up protected everything so first of all, this is what it came in. Does this look like a nice, sturdy, protective box? No. And then it came in that bag, but it also came in this. This is what they put it in to ship it off. This is what it originally came in. Are you serious? And it's all, it's ripped already. So, I know crackers and ch 
chip bags that are more sturdy than what this kit is. Now, from the beginning, I was always a little skeptical, so I did go through PayPal. Um, if, you have, um, if you're if you skeptical about any website, pay through PayPal because uh, they are able to help you get your money back if you are scammed or anything. So, definitely um, look at that as a... Um, as a way to kind of make yourself feel better so that's what I did because I was skeptical um, so when I first did it there was no progress when I ordered from the site they show you where you can look to see you know what stage the dress is in so the first thing it said was the payment um, they were, it was waiting on payment the payment was verified the order was sent to the factory they make each dress um, however they need to that's just, they make it for each size. They don't just have made dresses already. So I thought that was a good thing. I was like, okay, um, if you need customized measurements and stuff, you know, they say measure yourself, all that stuff. I measured myself. The sizing was great. So I was like, why isn't it changing? And then I seen that, like, oh, it was Chinese New Year. So they took, it was about two weeks no progress because they had were on vacation or whatever so okay i was like that's fine when they came off of vacation well the day that they said they were supposed to be off of vacation i called back okay they were still saying that they were on vacation till like two days after so i was like okay and then when i finally got a hold of somebody she's like oh they're not gonna be back in the factory until like five days i'm like okay i feel like i'm getting the runaround honestly and so I calmed down a little bit and I'm like, okay, she's like, oh, it's, it's finished. I'll send it to you, blah, blah, blah. So what I got was less than, and my prom is a month from tomorrow, I believe it's April 18th. And literally what I received broke me in two pieces and it just well first off when I called the lady she said that it was going to be green it's, it was supposed to be this nice turquoise color so she, she, it made me nervous when she was saying it was going to be green because when I think of green I honestly think of like something that looks like this when I think of green and that's not what I wanted at all I'm sorry, it's like making me upset. So, that made me nervous to get it. So, then I talked to somebody else and they said, oh no, it's great. Like, the color is how it was in the picture, whatever, whatever. So, I'm like, oh good. So, when I got it, I was just super, super excited. I think that it clouded my judgment in what it actually looked like. Um, it sucks to say that I feel like I was ripped off, honestly. Uh, my total came out to like $130. So, let me just show you guys the dress. I just, um, uh, I'm like so mad because I just filmed this part and you could not hear me at all. Um. My my cat came out, so it just sounded like I was super far away. So, let's start from the bottom of the dress. First off, starting from here, you may not be able to tell, but this was not cut nicely at all. It looked like somebody just took it with scissors and just went straight across. Um, I would never do this to anybody, especially because it is in the prom dress section. So I would assume it would be for somebody's prom, and I would put time and effort into doing that. And look at this. Okay, I hope you can see that, but... See the little holes in it? And the little jagged part? Like, are you kidding me? And then... Where's the part where they bind it together? 
And yes, I am nitpicking at every flaw this thing has. So, look at that. Look how they just sewed that together. Like, just give it like a slight tug and it's loose. And this is ridiculous. And it's here. Here's another one that has the string hanging out of it. Are you kidding me? And it's not even sewn together at the same part. One is shorter than the other. The string's hanging out. Look at that. And it's still loose. And look, here's a hole here. I have not worn this. I tried it on and it was too small. And I took it off. So this had me ready not to even go to prom anymore. I wanted nothing to do with this. I felt like it was ruined. This piece is longer than this one also again. You give this a little tug. I'm not pulling hard at all. And you can see how loosened it gets. Like this is ridiculous. <sighs> this material is supposed to be a silky material. It looks like it should be a silky material. It feels nothing like it. It feels dry as ever. Like oh my god. This is just ridiculous. This is probably the only part that is constructed, not nicely, but how it should be. I would have accepted, if oh, if the rest of the dress was constructed like this piece is constructed, I would have accepted it. But I cannot even. I would be embarrassed, embarrassed of myself if I was to go anywhere in this thing. And look, this is the side. This is not even... And it's still having that loose feel. And I wish somebody would have posted a video like this for me before I paid for this dress. And that's the reason I'm making this video. They give you extra buttons. Extra buttons. No st like string that or whatever. This is... So they have, look, this part right here is coming off. As soon as I take this off, I put this back in the bag. So <coughs> this part right here, this flower is literally coming off. This was not there. I didn't want that anyway. Like, it just looks so cheap to me. Like, I'm five three and a half five three and a half I am not very tall this just was supposed to be somewhere around 61 inches something like that around five feet or whatever that's from shoulders so let me show you guys the length of this dress and you tell me if this looks like I would even be able to walk in this thing. Let me show you guys. Okay. So, first off, it looks, does not even look like the dress. So, like, let's see how long I can do this. Going up. I can't even put my arm any further. Look at that. Does I just look at how long this thing is. Like, what? Like, putting it on, I would, it's, I'm stepping on it. Like, oh my god. This was not supposed to be this long. Oh my god, like, let's see. Measure it up. Starting from the top of my closet to the bottom. It is almost to the floor. That is ridiculously long. And it is just low quality material. I probably could have constructed this dress better than they did. And I hate it so much. And I hate that anybody would do that. And I'm pretty sure it is. it wasn't intentionally me, obviously, because they don't know me. I mean, I called multiple times. 
um, I assumed that it wasn't just because I was continuing to call and ask them about it that they decided to make me a bad dress. Um, and as I talk, I'm still finding pieces that are just not, like, I'm pretty sure, I mean, hey, it could have been me. But I would hope that nobody wants to do that to me. Um, I told them that there was an event that I needed for them and I contacted them because from the start, they never gave me a day that, <clears throat> an estimated delivery date because of they didn't know how long it was going to take. But still, I feel disrespected and disgusted by the lies that these people tell on their website um, about that is just so high quality. They make every dress, they design every dress um, that they put it in a, they put it in a nice plastic and mail it to you in these nice boxes and you can contact them anytime. They take a f more than a couple of days to contact you back if you email them. If you message them on the site, they take like sometimes at least three to five days to respond to you then and it's just terrible. When you call them, sometimes they don't answer, sometimes they hang up. Um, other times they, they just put you on hold and their office is disconnected from their factory. So sometimes they can't even answer questions. And I honestly just feel like I wouldn't want anybody else to go through this situation. It may seem just like a little thing to other people, but this was something important to me. This is my senior prom. And the fact that a dress and that a company who is telling lies about the quality of their products on their websites. And if you go to the reviews they have on their websites, they're all good. All of them. There's not one bad review. There's not one complaint at all. And they just look really fake. Every single one of them. You will not go there and see one thing below four stars. All of them are good. I've never seen that on any website. And I, from what I've seen online, they've been known to write their own reviews. And I'm not putting this video out to bash the company. Well, somewhat, but I'm more putting it out for information so I can let other people know and other kids who are going to prom and other people who have special events that they would like to um, look nice for don't buy from this company. I prefer like I was able to find a nicer dress that came in less time for less money. Honestly, their prices are good. Their quality is horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. I will never buy from this website again, ever. I would never recommend this to anyone, to anyone. Because the fact that a dress can make me not want to go to my own senior prom, like this is senior year. I need to be enjoying it. And the fact that something like this and the lies that these people tell and the BS that they fed me about their products could make me not want to do that. It's disgusting and it's despicable that you could lie to somebody who you can't even see like face to face who honestly just wants to look nice for an event and you can sit here and now you can lie to me and it's disgusting and it's despicable and they should be ashamed of themselves trying to give these products to people like Honestly, if I could report their site, I really would because they should not be able to make these types of dresses and send them to people and expect them not to say anything. And once they seen that I contacted them on PayPal, they decided to email me like on the side outside of PayPal and just say, Oh, we see that you started a claim through PayPal, which I did that same day so they so I could get my money back and that I wouldn't have to contact them on the side that PayPal can help with the contacting. So I was like they're like, Oh, well can you send me can you send me a picture of the products of what's wrong with it? I said, Look, 
It's not that something is wrong with it, which it, which it is, but it's, I just wanted it to be so simple where it's the fact that it doesn't fit. I don't want it anymore. But then I'm like, keeping my mouth shut isn't going to do anything. So the dress is terrible quality. It honestly doesn't even feel good on the skin. This feels like the cheapest thing that they could have possibly made this with. <sighs> it... It just, like, they should really be ashamed of themselves that they've put somebody like me, who is a genuinely really nice person and really sweet, through something so bad to make me not even want to do anything else. And I was ready to give up. But, I would like to, uh, um, <clears throat> I would just like to let all of you guys know. This is not a good website. Do not even try. I wouldn't buy anything on there. Whether it was a necklace, I wouldn't even buy socks from this website, honestly. And I just really wanted to let you guys know that this is what I've been through. And I've done it firsthand. Firsthand. And I'm still dealing with this situation. And I would definitely be emailing um <clears throat> the link to this video to them to their customer service to their twitter to their facebook and to all their social media because i want them to watch this video because it is ridiculous and i feel disrespected at the fact that you even thought that this could pass as a good dress you're insulting my intelligence but anyway so that's basically all I have to say. Um, thank you so much for watching this video. If any of you guys need to contact me, I'll put my... Um, or if any of you guys want to tell me any of your horror stories with prom dresses or any of your horror stories with websites, I'll leave my email down below or you could just leave a comment on this video. And I want to thank you guys and have a wonderful day.